red dye concrete because they only made it down three feet because it is solid rock. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Day number four of the utilities pouring concrete. It's supposed to be red, but it's not. Not very red, huh? All right, so it is day five of the underground, and looks like we are done. Um, they finished off their last, they probably only had 40 feet left to do, and I uh, can't believe they actually did it today. It's rainy and just nasty weather here but uh they got it done anyways so it looks like they even pulled the cable um i just want to make sure that my marker is still here yep okay so it is uh freaking butt cold it's like 28 degrees for the high it's raining and uh they came out here and worked anyways i'm pretty impressed so i'll show you real quick the final product down here at our property line and then I'll take you up to, I don't think we've seen the transformer really set or the, uh, the junction box set yet. So I'm going to show you both of those things and uh, then we will be done with our uh, underground utility series. All right, so my uh, truck picked up and turned off the recording but anyways all we did was drive up here to uh, this junction box and let's see if I can open it yep I'll show you what's inside without breaking it and so all this is is just so that they can uh, have a midway point if there's something wrong with the wire oh I just got grease all over me uh, they just have a midway point so that they can have um, if they have a problem with the wire, they don't have to replace a thousand feet. They can just replace 500 or they can isolate that problem. So that's all that is. You got me. Oh. <laughs> I, just... Oh, I just broke it. I broke it. I fixed it. Maybe. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay. Well, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, you know what that is for. All right, let's go up to the uh, transformer. So here is the transformer and pedestal. Show you inside the pedestal first, if we can get in it. Yep, let me see. So there's all the inner workings of the pedestal. They still have not tied in the uh, tent pole with a meter yet. Hopefully they're coming tomorrow to do that if the weather's not too bad, but uh, there's all that. That's feeding from this transformer right here feeding to the pedestal from the pedestal to the uh, meter. So I've actually never looked in one of these before, so this will be interesting. There we go. Oh, that's heavy. Oh, wow. Okay, nothing's hooked up, so we're good. 
Um, I'm guessing that's the out feed right there coming uh, probably out to the pedestal and then this is probably these red lines are probably coming in from the main. Um, the only reason why I say that is there's three wires there with uh, with three lugs and there's probably two, at least two wires inside that big heavy duty wire probably three to hook up to those bigger lugs over there so yeah pretty cool um, all of it's set and the uh, underground is officially underground electric is officially done so that's it for the underground I'm freezing my butt off so I'm going to uh, jump back in the truck it's late on day five uh, the sun is going down and uh, mama's got dinner going so I'm uh, gonna head home and uh, play with the kids and probably light a fire because it is freezing so until next time we will see you up on the ridge